Hold on. There we go. I decided to show my little hair today. Motherfucker wolfing though. Shit. You know, I just had to show show, show my hair today, man. My, I always got the wave cap on. I said, man, I'm going to break this shit out, man. Break this shit out. <laughs> I'm tired of making a lot of videos, I swear. <laughs> Yo, just looking at this shit is funny. But um, I had to make a live video because I, well, I was going to make a story, but it's going to be way too long. And I'm like, this shit is way too fucking long. But, um... So I came or somebody made a post, right? They didn't make a post, but they shared the post. So I'm like, all right, cool. So I'm looking at this post and this girl is wearing lingerie. And she big as hell. I ain't gonna lie. You know what I'm saying? I'm I'm not the one that's gonna pretend. And she's saying it it didn't her being big and wearing lingerie wasn't even what sparked my interest. What sparked my interest is where it where it says my ex boyfriend rates my plus size lingerie and I'm like, your ex boyfriend? What what the fuck? Why is your ex boyfriend rating your lingerie? Like why isn't your current boyfriend rating your lingerie? It doesn't make sense to me. Or you could just get any old nigga to, to rate lingerie. Why why would you go to your ex to y'all females need to stop that shit. Stop going to to back to your ex for for bullshit. You know what I'm saying? Either either get back with him or uh Leave them alone, like <clears throat> oh y'all be y'all be weird with y'all exes, man. Every time a bitch tell you I'm friends with my ex, I be like next because you on some weird shit. You know exes is exes for a reason. You got to ex them out your motherfucking life. Uh, my exes don't hit me up. You know what I'm saying? So I don't know what, what people be thinking about. Oh my ex is my friend. Like no, it, no. Anyway. So I'm gonna get into the video, man. But the, the dude was waiting in lingerie, and I could just tell that this was a fraudulent lie. So let me hold on. You know what? Let me do this right quick because it was a certain part, and I said, "Hold on, I gotta dig. I gotta do some research because I'm like, what are they talking about? Hold on, let me just." <laughs> Hold on. But now, no, I'm just kidding. But now, I definitely like you. How was our first kiss? All right. So, they was talking about their first kiss. But I got to get to this video. I got to get to this video. Because I could just see, I could just, I could tell. You know what I'm saying? I'm a man, and a man knows. You dig? So, anyway, let me just get into this video. Hold on. It's a three-piece set, and then I'll show you. Oh, okay, shit. <laughs> Had the flash on and shit. So, the dude... The dude is rating her lingerie, right? This is the dude. This is like comfy lounge. He's rating That's her like lingerie, right? right? <laughs> okay, cool. Fully in line. And this ain't about her being big. This ain't about that. This is about the lie that they told. You know what I'm saying? Like, don't lie to me. You know what I'm saying? Why would you lie to social media? That don't make any sense. But I'm going to get into the lie. Don't be distracted by she being a big girl. This ain't got nothing to do with nothing. Right? In front of my ex. Love this for us. I'm definitely a fan of the color. I like the little print on it, too. It's like, yeah, it's like leopard. It's like leopard. leopard. Yeah. But Hold on. Like, Hold on. It's not like, Hold on. Like, oh, shit. I'll give it 8.5. Fucking ads, man. I had a fucking ad. I already watched the video. I don't know why they give me another ad. With healthy extras, God make a damn. quarterly allowance for over-the-counter items. Hold on, Click man. Click now or visit bsca.com slash video to learn more. Bullshit, bro. Bullshit. Anyway. Back this up. Back this up. It's not like leopard. I'm definitely a fan of the color. I like the little print on it, too. Yeah, it's like leopard. It's like leopard. But I love it because it's like discreet. It's not like no, extra. Yeah. I'll give you an 8.5. I feel that. You're so cool. Up what next, the fuck was that? Little... Hold on. You're so cool. What? Up Hold on. Let's show it again. I feel that. You're so cool. Up next. This nigga here. I'm motherfucking tired of y'all. I know. I, I, I swear I am. Oh. Uh. I'm sorry, man. I had to take a break. Oh, fuck.
I didn't even see that part. Oh, my God. I know they axes, but I mean, what the fuck was that? This nigga, this nigga did some... This nigga, bro. I need to find a phone stand just so I can walk off camera for a minute because that didn't make any damn sense. That, that was, what, the, what the fuck was... Hold on, let's see it again. Hold on. You're so cool. Up next, we're getting... This nigga, bro. I ain't gonna comment on on dude. I ain't gonna comment on him. I'm I'm just here for the lie. That's all I'm here for. I'm honest to God. <laughs> yeah, it's just it's just too much going on right here, and I I don't want to come at her, and I don't want to come at him. You know what I'm saying? I don't wanna I don't wanna I don't wanna I don't wanna do that. But um. Uh, Listen, bro. If that's your ex, and this nigga did, this nigga, this nigga, this nigga ain't even come with a high five. What was that? This nigga, this nigga did this. She came with this. This nigga came with this. What the fuck was that? I don't understand. Listen, man. I don't know what y'all got going on, but uh, hey. Hey, it is what it is, man. Everybody different, man. Everybody gonna live their life how they gonna live it. But um, <clears throat> if if um, listen, listen, man. <laughs> if you gonna sit up here and if that's your ex, and if if my ex was wearing lingerie in front of me. I'm not going to give her, if she goes for a high five, I'm not going to give her the backhand and not even complete the high five. Like, I don't, I don't understand. Like, that shit was funny. It didn't, it, it was just too much going on here. Like, even the dude was, she was like, describe this lingerie. He was like, I like the color. I like the print. So play it again. Hold on. It's not like no, extra. Yeah. I'm giving it 8.5. Look, look, look. What the fuck was that? What the fuck was that? I mean, my my listen, man. If if dude going to give it an eight point five, if you if you if you look at your ex and you say, yeah, your lingerie is an eight point five, I'm expecting you to you to smack her on the ass or something. You know what I mean? Like, I don't expect a, a your hand to go backwards to her high five. Like, I just don't understand. Like. That to me was just weird. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, I gotta move on because I make this video five hours. So we're getting a little uh, holiday vibe with this color. What was that face? Mm -hmm. You don't know about this one. Mm -hmm. You're not feeling that? I can tell. I'm not feeling this one. I'm definitely gonna have to go at seven. Oh, that's still decent. You're being nice. I mean, it's really. Oh, it has nothing to do with me. Okay, cool. It's definitely still popping. The, I on would say it's you, so soft. On you, I don't like this one. Look at her face. Up. Like, in our Hold on. I, I swear to I swear. I'm not going to come at dude. I'm not going to come at dude. Like, but look. Look. Let's see a learning lesson, ladies, okay? Whoever you're with or around may not like what you have on, but it's about how you feel. Are you nodding your head back there? Hater. Zoom it. Zoom it. Listen, I ain't gonna come at dude, but this nigga had the duck lips. <laughs> they, she said that's her ex. Hey, listen. Hey, this dude had the duck lips. If y'all niggas out here doing duck lips, hey, that's y'all niggas, man. But hey, I'm looking at it just like y'all. This nigga hit the duck lips. <laughs> this is my color, like all day. Like this is my to me. Really? Really? Yes. Not ten. I love this so much. Nothing else needs to be said. Look! 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 Okay. <laughs> look at this nigga. This nigga rubbing his eyes and shit. This nigga. 
You got you got to rub the back of my neck. You feel me? This nigga said. This nigga said that's a ten. I'm not I, listen. If that's what he like. That's what he like. But listen, man. <laughs> oh shit! Listen, man. If <laughs> if this. It, that, that's the intro to Gold Link, but anyway, um, no, that's the intro to um, to Caroline. You find you a dom piece, man. <laughs> One of the Beyonce making good types. <laughs> but anyway, man, like sheesh. If if listen, if your ex is wearing lingerie, you sit to sit here and you fit to say that's a ten, and your face look like this, you lying. You lying. I'm just keeping the bean. You lying, bro. Like, you ain't got to lie. This, this, <laughs> this shit is, the more I watch it, the funnier it gets because you have to learn the art of micro expressions and picking up on people's faces and body language. If you know what I'm talking about, you would know this nigga lying. Like, <laughs> if a nigga see a 10, if a nigga see, if a nigga, Bruh, if a nigga see a bad bitch, he ain't finna do all that. Hold, can I pull it up? Pull it up right quick. Hold on. Hold on. <clears throat> I'm gonna show y'all. I'm gonna show y'all what the dude face look like when he see it. When he see a bomb bitch. When he see it. When he see. When he see a ten. Hold on. Hold on. No. Hold on. <clears throat> If that was a 10, hold on. Let me see if I can find a face. Let me see if I can find Hold on, hold on. Hold on. Century two. I'm going to show you the face of a man. When he says that's a 10, I'm going to show you the face. Hold on. This the face. This the face right here. That's the face. Let's go to the face again. Look, look, look. You see that face? You, you see that smile? That's what you supposed to look like. This nigga face was like this. He was like this, dog. That nigga said, yeah, something like that. <laughs> If she, I'm just saying, I'm just saying. <laughs> this, this nigga face. Look, 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 look. This nigga said a ten. I love pearls. I'm so into pearls. So this is four pieces. So it's an underwear and bralette set, and then well, this pearl thing like is clasps similar to. This nigga start yarning. In the back. This nigga start yarn. He gonna try to play the yarn off like. This nigga said a ten, folk. He said a ten. This man, this man, you seen this shit? Hold on, my fucking hair. This nigga literally started yarning. This nigga said, "Yeah, yeah it's a ten." <laughs> I was the guy. This nigga said, "This nigga said, yeah." Yes, ten. <clears throat> tens, tens, and ten, ten, tens, hand down is going out all around. This nigga, but this nigga not even smile. Like, bruh, like, ladies, I'm just saying, listen, ladies. <sighs> Wait, hold on. Sit down. Little Yates got shot? God damn. I don't know who that is, but um, that's what I said. This, this is what I said in my last live, ladies. If your man can't be honest with you, he not a man. He not he not your man. He's not a man at all because men don't lie. If, if that shit was a three to him, he just said a three. His face doesn't say ten to me. You know what I'm saying? Anytime you see a man and he says he's looking, you know what I'm saying? I wish I could find some reaction videos, but I don't have time. You know what I'm saying? Motherfuckers be like, damn. Like, ooh. 
Ooh, look at oh, 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 yeah. You know what I'm saying? That's how motherfuckers' face supposed to be. If you're really a ten and niggas is really liking what you have on, niggas really liking them hips, niggas really liking them thighs, niggas really liking that face. That's how they face finna be. Your face ain't finna be like this. You know what I'm saying? Like, j just don't lie to me. Don't, don't try to put on this fake facade on on social media. And this man is clearly not even interested in what you have on. Even if it, even if it's your ex, he still like, you know what I'm saying? That reminiscence is supposed to come like, damn, you know what? Yeah, she did have that large ray on last Christmas, man. I tore that ass up. Ooh, you know what I'm saying? All those memories are supposed to come back. But this man clearly was yarning. So, hey, listen. Even if I was, I mean, I already know that's not her ex. I already know that's not her boyfriend. But even if I was to entertain the idea, something was trash. You know what I'm saying? Something was, was not right. Because that man just straight yarned. And like, uh, what is happening? Like, you got a woman beside you wearing lingerie that you supposedly hit. They said they was dating for three years. So, I mean, you can go to her channel. <clears throat> They say they was dating for three years or whatever. Uh, so, I don't know. No, this was a repost. This was a repost. I don't know when this was originally posted on her page. But anyway, man, I got to move on because this shit was funny as hell. Did like, come on. This man ain't had no recollection of, of them smashing, you know, and it was being the best thing in the world. This man straight yarn when she had on lingerie. This, like, we not there. This man is there. This man sees the cheeks out. And he's just, uh, motherfucking ten though. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> pretend though. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, man. So this is how I know it's a lie. So I got. I'm gonna get into this right quick. So I, I had to go on the page. I had. To, I'm like, let me investigate, man, because this shit it don't seem right. And I only clicked on it because it said the ex boyfriend was rating lingerie, and I'm like, what? So then when I seen the video, I was like. What is this nigga doing? This nigga body language is not speaking X type vibes. Like it's not like this nigga this nigga gave her like the backhand high five. And I'm like, <clears throat> if my ex walked through the door right now, I'm tearing that ass up. Like it, it, I'm not, even though that's my ex, I you know, I'm like, well, how bitch, how did you find me? But I'm finna tear that ass up. I'm not finna give Hey, you know, yeah, mm, backhand high five. Like, no, I don't even fuck with some of my exes, but if they come through the door, I'm not giving no, I'm smacking that ass. Like, how'd you find me, bitch? But since you here, bend that ass over. So anyway, <clears throat> they asked, how was they first kiss? I had to go to the page. And this is, hold on, I got to turn. How was, shit, how was your first kiss? So they about to answer this question, so hold on. So our first kiss. <laughs> this nigga, hold on, that right. This, hold on. She said, "How was the first kiss?" This nigga, bro. Both of them, really. She laughed. This nigga, this nigga was. Hold on, I can't even do the face. I can't even do the face. This nigga did. Hold on, play it again. How was our first kiss? So our first kiss. <laughs> this nigga said. <laughs> this nigga said. <clears throat> like damn, nigga. Like what the fuck? Bro. Listen, I know you lying. I know you lying. If I was to even entertain the thought that this was real, her breath must. Had some horrible motherfucking odor that was ungodly to 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 God's nose or something. I don't know. I don't know what the fuck happened. How was your first kiss? <clears throat> like his whole face. Like it's, it's, she's 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 laughing because she's in on a lie. This nigga like oh shit like. Come on, stop lying. That's what I'm saying, man. That's why some of this YouTube shit, I just really be like, man, this shit is really fake. Like, it, it's too much fraudulence going on. Like, motherfuckers got fraudulent motherfucking... Hold on, play it again. Play it again. So, our first kiss... 
this nigga said, mm, like, <coughs> like this bitch had 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 a dead tooth or something. He just remembered the smell. That's how this nigga face. This nigga's face was like not even so pleasant. <laughs> Ladies, if you kid, if you ask your boyfriend or one of your exes, how was your first kiss? And that nigga did something like that, baby. You need to listen. Go go to the dentist or something. I mean, they said this was three years ago. I don't know how our grill was looking. It's like <laughs> you just remember something that just was like not nice. Like this nigga said. <clears throat> Like, like you just like yeah, that was the day. <laughs> you remember? You remember some shit? You be like, yeah, that was the day I came home, and I seen the bill, and that shit was three thousand dollars. Like that's how that nigga face was. Like that's nigga, like yeah, man, I came home, the water bill was three thousand dollars. They said I had to pay it, and I was mad as shit. Like that's like you see a parking ticket. Like you just come outside, you, mm, fucking motherfucking parking ticket. Like that's how his face was. Like hold on. This shit is this shit is hilarious to me. I gotta play it again. Hold on. I just kind of kept to myself, but my girls, they knew. How, how was our first kiss? So our first kiss. <laughs> I know I'm dragging this out, but this shit is funny. I'm gonna play it now. I'm gonna play it. I'm gonna play it. Are all about transparency and keeping it real with you guys. So basically, our first kiss um, was good. Basically. From my impression, I'll tell you my perspective. So, the bad thing that I'm, I am like hesitant is that we both were in relationships, which is not good. But um, Tyler would come over my house. They said they was both in relationships, and then they had a kiss. This shit didn't even begin right. It didn't even begin on good terms. They both in relationships. And they kissing other people. So the relationship didn't even, even if I was to entertain this lie, it didn't even begin right. It didn't even begin right. It, it started fucked up. So, hang out a lot, like strictly so basically, they both cheating. They, they, they cheating, bro. Like, long story short, they both cheating. If I was to entertain this, they cheating. And they just lying. Please, friends. And one day, I just like... It was the first day he showed me that I felt like he had something to me because, or towards me because we both were in situations, but I felt like if we had met before those situations, we would have gotten together. Like there were definitely feelings there or like emotions there, but we had to get them to us. <laughs> Yo, I can't play poker with this nigga. I can't play go fish with this nigga. I can't play nothing with this. I can't play spades. This nigga can't be my spades partner. This nigga, hold on. Oh, shit. definitely feelings there or like emotions there, but we have Yo, she said it was feelings there. It was definitely emotions there. This nigga said... I don't like when people lie to my face like that. I just, I was just disrespectful. Put them away because, like, we're in these oh, oh, shit. Like, that's not right. <sighs> but one day, when I parked, like, Tyler's in my car. We had driven from school. I, like, lived down the street. We parked, and we're, like, walking to my elevator. He was, like, more, you were, like, more touchy with me. And not, like, you know, grabbing my booty touchy. Not, like, inappropriate touchy. But just, like, you were just touching me more. I don't know. And I, like, really noticed that. And I was, like, oh, my God. Like, I'm just having all the feels. So then... We were sitting on my couch talking. Now you know that. Was this this nigga first kiss? Like, obviously it wasn't his first kiss because he was in another relationship. <sighs> Man, this nigga, bro. This, this story is just. And you know it's fake. You know it's fake because she's describing it. She's describing it. And it just sounds like some girl shit. You know what I'm saying? It just sounds like he what he didn't touch the booty. He was just touchy. He touched the shoulder. Like 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 picture this. Picture this, right? So so this this is what the nigga did. This, this, <laughs> this 
This is what the nigga did. They was in the parking lot. This nigga said. And then waiting for the kids. That is some weird ass shit. Ain't no way. Ain't no way. Listen, I, I, listen, I've been a virgin before. Ain't no, ain't no way my ass is touching some shoulder. Like, like you, you, you want a kiss, baby? You want, you want a kiss? Like, what the fuck? Like, he ain't, like, I'm just saying, I'm just saying, ain't no, what, what you mean? He was, he was touchy. But he wasn't touching the booty. Like he ain't grabbed no thigh. He ain't grabbed no ass. He ain't grabbed the titty. He ain't grabbed. He ain't grabbed the back of the neck. It's so many things to grab. <laughs> you don't grab no shoulder, cause like you don't grab no shoulder. Hold on. I, you were just touching. Hold on. Me. Like, walking to my elevator. He was like, you were like more touchy with me, and not like you know grabbing my booty, touchy, not like inappropriate touchy, but just like. You were just touching me more. I don't know. And I, like, really noticed that. And I was like, oh, my God. Like, I'm just having all the feels. So then we were sitting on my couch talking. And then we just kissed. She said he was having all the feels. Of she, I don't know who the, what the fuck she was saying in the lie. I just knew it was a lie. This motherfucker touched her arm, her shoulder. And then they started talking. And then he just kissed her. Like, that was... It would, it would just be so awkward. Like... I'd be like, what the fuck? Like, fellas, can you imagine, like, a girl just touching your shoulder? Like, y'all not even, like, are y'all facing each other? Like, you just facing each other, like, you just touch her arm. And you don't, then you just go in for the kiss. Like, <clears throat> that's like one of those, that's like one of those French kisses where, where they be like, oh, welcome. And then they go for the hug, then they kiss both sides of the cheek. That's how that shit was. Like, that shit wasn't no motherfucking romance. You know what I'm saying? Like, he wasn't touchy, though. He wasn't touchy, and they was dating for three years, and they not married. We see why, but come on, man. I just don't lie to me. Like, hold on. We, I got to move on with the video. And, but we both knew it was wrong. We both definitely knew it was wrong. We said, like, we just need to be friends, like, right away. And that was the cool thing about us is a lot. Here they go, this nigga with the duck lips again. Hold on. I got to zoom out, though, because this nigga did some hand shit. just need to be friends, like, right away. And this nigga... Bro, come on, man. This is supposed to be... Hold on. Hold on. <clears throat> Wait. I didn't put this... In. This is this is when they was a couple. The last video was uh, recent. I think it was recent. But this was supposed to be a couple years ago. This was, what, two years ago? This was this was last year. All right, well, this was last year. Okay. That's, that's even worse. But, um... <clears throat> anyway, so this was last year, and this this is supposed to be them as a couple describing how they first met. So this nigga, this nigga was like, nah. This nigga, this nigga face, this nigga face is like, oh my gosh, this nigga face is like, you know how all my fellas know what I'm talking about. But when you be with your homeboy, and some of y'all girls know too, when you when you out with your friends. And they be like, that's who you dating? <laughs> the nigga finna do that. This this finna be the nigga. That's who you dating? That was a cool hold on, hold on. Said, do like, the, we just need to be friends. That's who you dating? <laughs> that's that's the shit. That's who you dating? Hell no. You know what I'm saying? They supposed to be a couple right now, though. You know what I'm saying? We 100% bounced back and went back to being friends for two years. For like, like a full year, we were friends. And like, I transferred schools. I moved. So the lie she's trying to sit up here and sell is they kissed. He was he was touchy. They kissed and then they went back to being friends for a year or two. What? You know what I'm saying? Like <laughs> what nigga? What nigga is doing some shit like that? Yo, I'm just saying, yo, I'm just saying like if I kiss a girl, oh shit, and she say we gonna go back to friends because we in relationships right now. Like you done already cheated, basically. You done, you done, you done crossed the path of cheating. 
So you then you kiss and then you remain friends for a year or two. Now listen, I'm not a square. I, mean, I am a square, but um, whatever y'all do in y'all lives, I don't I don't know. But um, I I've just never heard of that. I've never experienced that where I'm going to kiss a girl, even if I'm I, I never cheated. But even if I'm going to cheat, I'm not going to sit up here and be like, <clears throat> I'm touch on your shoulder, and then I'm gonna come in for a kiss. Now, we're going to go back to friends for about a year or two and get back together or, or, or become a couple. Like, what the fuck is going on here? Like, this shit, this shit is just astronomical. Like, why lie? Why lie? Why sell this lie to social media? Like, you can do whatever you got to do. If you want to do whatever you want to do on social media, that's cool. But you don't have to sit up here and create a 28-minute lie. Like, you don't have to. It was really unnecessary to do. Hold on, I gotta get back to this video. Look at this nigga face again. Go to New Orleans, and we would FaceTime all the time. We talk about your relationship. Like I would, like I would say good stuff. Like if they were going through it, I'd be like, you know, work through it. Like you got it, whatever. And like same with me, I was going through it with my relationship because like my dude was back in Chicago and I was in New Orleans now. Um, but yeah, don't you know what I'm saying? Don't hurt people <laughs> in the process. But that was not our plan. We didn't want. We're both really good people. We never wanted to hurt anybody. But when you have that attraction to someone that, like, you can't fight, sometimes that's just what happens. I was pressing the wrong button. Attraction is what she said. You touch somebody on the shoulder, you go on for a kiss, and y'all become friends for about a year or two. And she's telling me attraction. Like, if she was, like, I'm just saying, man. <clears throat> If I met her in real life and this like this wasn't even on YouTube, this is just a story that somebody was telling me, I'd be like, bitch, you lying. Like that's how I know girls lie. Like I, I first of all I know when y'all lying. But the th this story is just not adding up. And this is how y'all girls lie. Y'all lie exactly like how this bitch is lying right here. And this is how I know y'all lying. <clears throat> y'all was y'all was y'all it was an attraction for a year or two, but y'all didn't move on it. Y'all cheat, y'all, y'all, listen, listen, man. The attraction was so strong that y'all cheated it, but y'all didn't go through with it? What the fuck? What is happening? But then she's going to talk about, oh, the attraction was strong. How was it strong? Listen, no, nah, I'm going to just move on. Yeah. So what do you, I just like took the whole show on that just because I know it's a lot for us to put out. He going to describe how the kiss so was. Your impression of our first kiss? Lips were a lot juicier than I thought. Uh, of course, a man's perspective. This nigga. <clears throat> she said, I was the first kiss. This nigga said, Um, what the fuck? Like, what? How the fuck did you even fix your mouth and say some shit like that? He didn't, your lips was juicy. Listen, man. You know that nigga lying. They both lying. Listen, <clears throat> I'm a, I'm gonna say it right. I'm gonna say it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put it down. Let me see. I got I got to pick an ex. Uh, all right. One of my exes, right? And she was a big girl, so I'm gonna pick one of my big exes. I seen her walking down the street, right? She had a nice ass on her. You feel me? She was short too. I'm looking, I'm like, damn, light skin too, red bone. I'm like, Ooh. just to describe, just to describe, like, this is how niggas go into detail with their kisses, though. So I seen it, right? I'm like, damn. But I can't remember, I can't remember how it all went down. This was like over 10 years ago. So I'm looking, I'm like, damn. So I think I called her over. I'm like, you called her over, right? She come over, you know what I'm saying? We get to talking. And uh, I was like, what's your name? She's like, my name Pauline. You know, big girl name. And so, you know, I'm like, ooh. So, you know, we get to talking and shit. And then, uh, I don't even know how it all went down. I'm just tell you, I'm gonna just skip to the kids. I don't remember how the shit went down, but I remember the kids, though. You know what I'm saying? That's how vivid this shit is. You know what I'm saying? We, um, your lips are juicy. I ain't no nigga saying no shit like that, man.
<laughs> if your shit was real, ain't nobody saying no shit like that. Motherfucker be like, yeah. So I seen a right. So we got we we start talking, we get the name. I get I get the number, right? And I was like, yo, you know, let me get a kiss, shawty. So she gave me this kiss, and I'm telling you, man, this kiss was so motherfucking good. Man, I'm trying to tell you. So her lips was like pillows, fam. She has a Woo! DSL for my back in the day players. Some DSLs, my nigga. Woo! So pillows, my nigga, pillows, right? So I'm sitting up there, we kissing, right? So she had some uh she had the yellow juicy fruit. She was chewing on some gum. She had the yellow juicy fruit. So when I kiss her, right, I'm just getting all this juicy fruit flavor in my mouth. And I'm just like, damn, yo, like, what the fuck? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, it, it was some uh, some other shit. You feel me? And I'm like, I'm like, damn, like, I'm just I'm just feeling I'm feeling pillows on my motherfucking lips. And I take I'm tasting the gum at the same time. So you get in you get in soft texture, sweet flavor. And it's like it just hit you both at the same time. You feel me? And that's and and she gave me a little bit of tongue too. So you know we just we just in there just getting it in. You feel me? And I'm like, ooh, we. You feel me? Like, and she was a big girl too. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, oh man, like I'm, I'm gonna have to start fucking with big girls. You feel me? And she big too. You feel me? So, uh, first of all, look at those lips. This nigga said your lips was. This, first of all, this nigga said, um, this nigga started with the um, and then he said, your lips was juicy. Like, what the fuck? Like, this nigga ain't start with the juicy. This nigga said, um, first, and then came with the juicy. So, nigga, I know you're lying. Like, or, or you just didn't like it or something. I don't know what was going on in that. Like, when you remember some things, just how like, I remember some things, that's how it was. You know, out of all the kisses, that was probably the best kiss, um, that I had, man. It was just that juicy fruit did it for me, man. That motherfucking gum did it, man. You know what I'm saying? Extra flavor on that motherfucker. So, anyway, man. Hold on. Is this the end of the video? But, uh, yeah. Your lips were a lot juicier than I thought. Hold on. Your lips were a lot juicier than I thought. She did the head turn. She did the arm wave. Like, what the fuck? That's what that gesture was. That's what that was. She was just like, damn. Uh, <laughs> when she did that, this nigga did this. Uh, this nigga, that micro, it was a second. This nigga face was like, oh, shit. She didn't like the way I said that. No, nigga, she didn't like the way you said that. Nigga, this nigga was like, damn, I yeah. fucked up, didn't Where's I? Man's look, 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 look. <laughs> this nigga said, this nigga said, <laughs> real quick, though. He did it real quick. You know what I'm saying? You got to peep that shit. You know what I'm saying? This is how I know motherfuckers be lying. The art of lying, the art of deception. Come on, man. You can't pull one over on me. Where's a man's perspective, right? Like, That's how I just know they was lying. I'm just pointing out. I'm just highlighting what they were saying. I mean, I didn't make them say it. I didn't tell them to say it. I didn't pay them to say it. They said it. I was just I was just observing. And I was like, man, this nigga lying. This, that, now, see, this how the lie was. They didn't say the kiss was juicy. I mean, he said it was juicy. But they didn't say it was. Was it a peck? Was it a French kiss? Was it you just connected and just stay connected? Was it, one of the, was it a church kiss? They didn't say which kiss it was. Obviously, it was on the lips. Well, they didn't even say it was on the lips. They didn't even say it because you, you could tell the bitch got some juicy lips. That she could did it on your cheek. They really didn't say. They really didn't describe how the kiss was in detail, like how I described it. You know what I'm saying? Like, was there tongue, no tongue? Like, how was it? Did you pull back? Some, some spit was there. You know what I'm saying? Was it nasty, nasty? You know what I'm saying? Like, how was it? You know what I'm saying? Like... When dudes tell stories, man, and especially when we tell fucking stories, like, 
or getting it in stories. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna keep it. I'm gonna keep it a little PG thirteen. When we tell getting it in stories, uh, they ain't like that. They ain't nothing like that. You know what I'm saying? It's more detail in there. You know what I'm saying? Like, mm-mm. Especially when you're young, we telling we telling every motherfucking thing. We going to full detail, man. We gonna we, we having a full pornographic picture. Coming out of the motherfucking mouths, man. We're going to say everything that happened. Like, motherfuckers be lying. Why lie? But anyway, man, that's that's the end of this, man. Because I, I can't take any more. I, I just just these few. It wasn't, even, uh, it wasn't even 30 minutes. And I'm just like, lie after lie, gesture after gesture. That's just uncomfortable and awkward. And I was like, let me hear this first kiss story. This is plus more. Please. They better not say they had sex, because I know the fuck they lying in. I know the fuck. Come on. But anyway, man, I'm up out of here, man. But, uh, yeah, y'all got to stop fraud, man. Y'all got to stop lying, man. Y'all need to come with the truth, man. Like, stop having these fake relationships on social media. Everybody's looking at these relationships like they're the best thing in the world. And then when shit falls apart and y'all not finna keep up this facade anymore... Then people are like, what happened? I knew relationships would never work. You know what I'm saying? No, be real. Be genuine with your, with your relationships. If you're going to have it on social media, because other people are watching. You might have you might have an 18-year-old girl that never been in a relationship watching this relationship. And she watching how it fall apart. And motherfuckers arguing. She's the, the, the girlfriend is crying or whatever the case may be. And y'all just lying. And people are watching this. You know what I'm saying? That's why I got to make this video because there may be somebody watching this, looking at this relationship and say, oh my God, this relationship is so perfect. I want my relationship to be like that. And you're not even in a relationship or a relationship is fake or you're having problems in a relationship and it's not working out, but you're still continuing this facade on social media. Like everything's okay in a relationship and it's really not. And then later on, y'all just break up and the person... like. You can't sit up here and don't ever watch something and be like, oh, yeah, and then idolize that. You know what I'm saying? That's another thing. Don't idolize things on social media. Um, just just take it for what it is. You know what I'm saying? Entertainment. Uh, these people make these videos for entertainment. I'm just keeping it a bean. Unless they're talking about uh, giving a relationship advice and things of that nature, just take it for what it is, entertainment. Don't sit up here and take it for the gospel or oh, I want my relationship to be like that and you're not in that relationship. Worry about your own relationships. You know what I'm saying? That's why I just have to make this live video, man, because I want motherfuckers to be out here lying, man. I hate motherfucking people out here lying. Like, you don't have to lie. You don't. You can just keep the beans. Just keep it 100. You know? I'm, I'm single as a Pringle. This guy's going to rape my lingerie. I really don't know him. Or he's a good or a good friend of mine is gonna is gonna talk to me about some stuff. You just could have just said that. You didn't have to go into this whole fake facade and have me make a video, and I'm seeing y'all micro expressions on how y'all motherfucking lying. It was really uncalled for. But anyway, let me get up out of here, man.